What's up everyone, we're back for another episode of Code Geass, and the last episode was pretty hard for Lelouch, he went through some painful experiences with Shirley, and in the end, he decided to just erase some of her memories, and even the ones about Lelouch. Of course, now, we have to worry about Mao, who for some reason, really wanted Shirley to kill Lelouch and then kill herself. We still don't know why he wanted to do that. It seems like he has nothing against Zero and he doesn't care about that. He just wanted to kill Lelouch for some other reasons. He did call him a thief at one point. Maybe he calls him a thief because he stole Cece's Gias. I mean, he didn't really steal it, she gave it to him, but Mao doesn't know that. Anyways, I wonder when he's gonna show up again. But, without further ado, let's just start watching this episode. True, so... What type of other Gias exists? 500 meters? Yo, these Gias abilities are broken! <laughs> I mean, I'm not so sure about that. Yo, that is true, though. That is scary. So, you're gonna have to just kill him with your fist, with a gun, with anything. So, all the time he's always hearing everybody's mind? That doesn't sound pleasant. Look at that, it makes him go crazy. Why is he even in the library then? If I was him, I would just get the hell out of there. Oh, so that's why he wears headphones. That explains it. <laughs> but for some reason, he listens to recordings of CC. <laughs> Is this dude trying to buy a gun or something? What a bastard using his powers for this. <laughs> Hold up, I didn't know this. She did, huh? Yo, that's kind of fucked up. Oh,捨てるときになぜ始末しなかった? <laughs> He wants to meet with Euphemia? Alright, he's definitely gonna be here night. I mean, no one besides her by the looks of it. Oh, and the Ashford family? So, she's not even gonna recognize Lelouch? Hold up. Isn't Ash Ford gonna be like, what the fuck just happened? It's gonna be a long while. Wait, he's gonna burn her diary? <laughs> of course it is. Wait. She actually lived? What the fuck? She knows who Zero is. Well, that settles it. We don't gotta worry about her anymore. Whoa! 
っとそのぬがせるのは目をつむってもできたんだが。Sure, buddy. とりあえずいい人に拾ってもらったみたい。Hold up, are these two about to have a thing? Okay, she's acting. This is bullshit. Is it because he's nearby? I don't think that's gonna work on her. But then that probably means that Mao's g e a s doesn't work on her either. It was worth a shot. <laughs> Wait, is she actually serious? Is she only doing this to help Lelouch? Well, that's sweet, but I'm pretty sure that Lelouch doesn't want that. Don't tell me this man just wants to have a carnival date with her. Oh my god. That's exactly what's going on, huh? Oh, so it doesn't work on her. Nah, man, that shit ain't ever gonna happen. Just accept it. Hold up. So she met him when he was just a little kid? Alright, well, that makes sense. Yo! Yo, but she just killed the kid that she saved and looked after. <laughs> This man is clearly crazy. Yo! I mean, we know that her wounds are gonna heal, but what the hell is he gonna do? Kidnap her? In Australia? That's where they're going? <laughs> This guy can't believe it. <laughs> He's here? Is he here with the Black Knights? Oh no, he's here alone. So he's just gonna do this through a camera? How's that gonna work? Does his Giaz work through a camera? I never thought about that. Is he gonna try to make him jealous or something? Belongs to me. Those are some strong words right there. That is true. I mean, it was accidental, but it's true. Wait, who's watching this? Oh, now everyone's gonna think that he's crazy and they're not gonna believe when he says who Zero is. How the hell did he get all the cops here? Wait, he was right there the whole time. <laughs> That's called a recording, my friend. <laughs> yeah, and now no one's gonna believe him when he says that man right there is zero. Dang, yo, he really thought of a good ass plan, huh? I guess that's one way to solve it. She looked after him. Clearly. Yeah, 
Yeah, it is kind of fucked up that she just left him, but he went crazy. That's right, that's why Lelouch is the protagonist. Yo, I feel like she might start to like him. I mean, look at how much of a man he's being right now. <laughs> Shoot, maybe after completing the contract, they'll end up together. Alright, well, turns out that Mao's story was kind of fucked up. He was just a little boy when CC met him, and she basically saved his life. She made a contract with him. Gave him Gias, looked after him, taught him. She said that she even became his lover, so clearly he became in love with her. However, he was young, he was just a kid, and Gias is a very powerful tool which not everyone can control. Clearly, Mal couldn't. Look at him now, he was completely crazy, he was obsessed with CC. He wanted to do everything to try to take her from Lelouch. But Lelouch was able to win thanks to two things about Mao's Gias. One is that it only goes up to 500 meters. And two, that's only if he's concentrating enough. And at the end, he just ordered all the cops to shoot him. I mean, I'm sure that CC feels responsible for this. Because she should. But... What can you do? She's got a new man now, Lelouch. And he is willing to do everything that he can to fulfill his dream and Cece's contract. Those two have such an interesting relationship. Anyways, I'm excited for the next episode, so I'll see you there and I hope you guys stick around.